Early in the U.S. space program, engineers realized there would be times when astronauts would need a special spacesuit to be used outside their spacecraft. Repairs and adjustments to equipment on the space shuttle and later the International Space Station were a constant necessity. For instance, a very complicated installation of a new airlock on the ISS in 2001 involved several astronauts being what we call extravehicular for many hours. Early spacesuits were custom built for each astronaut's body size. Later, extravehicular mobility units, or EMUs, used for spacewalks on the shuttle or ISS were constructed from a stock of standard sized parts designed to fit astronauts with a wide range of measurements. This saved money and also made getting ready for a spacewalk easier and quicker. Above all, the EMU has to be a completely self-contained environment, containing a breathing system with automatic carbon dioxide gas removal, a cooling and ventilation system, a food and water supply, waste elimination system, and radio for communication. Heart function is also monitored through this communications link. An adult-sized diaper with extra material for liquid absorption is used for waste management. All of this technology is encased in 14 layers of synthetic materials, including layers to protect the body against fire, micrometeoroid strikes, and abrasion damage from work being performed. One of the protective layers is Kevlar, which is used in bulletproof vests and other high-impact, high-risk applications. The EMU has evolved in step with the missions themselves, from simple short-term protection to a full-function independent living system.